Hi, I'm Simon Allardyce, and this is TypeScript The Big Picture. This is a technical introduction to the TypeScript language. It's mainly for developers, but this would also work for technical project managers, systems engineers, or DevOps. Basically, it's for anyone who may either soon be writing TypeScript code or working with people who do. What is a little different here is the focus. Most language courses just immediately zoom in on the syntax because that's the easy thing to talk about. And we'll get to the syntax. But first, we're going to stay zoomed out for a moment and get clear on why TypeScript. What's it for? Why do you use it? What problems does this solve? How do you know if it's a good fit for the project you're working on? Or a bad fit? Do you know what it's good at and maybe what it isn't so good at? We're going to talk a lot about the relationship between TypeScript and JavaScript. We'll go over multiple examples of code. I'll show you what it's like both writing TypeScript and debugging it. And I'll cover the most common questions developers have when starting with this language. I'll talk about how to create and configure TypeScript projects, and even how to approach converting existing projects to TypeScript. But to have the big picture of anything implies perspective, that we keep a slightly higher level viewpoint so that we understand how TypeScript fits into the larger scheme of things. What are the other technologies this is commonly used with? What do you and your team need to know before you get started? What are the tools you're going to use? And unlike some other courses, here you don't have to follow along with everything I'm typing as long as you understand why I'm typing it. Sure, if you want to pause and try some stuff out, great. But this is a course you can just watch and just get a really good overview of the TypeScript language, how it works, what you need, how to think about it, how to write it, and where it fits in today's development. You have context, you have background, you have the big picture.